guys welcome back to the channel today we have a brand new generator from gen max this is a portable inverter generator but this one has one thing special it is efi fuel injected generator all right so it's an electronic fuel injected generator no more carbureted it's fuel injected so easy start in colder condition and higher elevations so you don't have to worry about uh, changing jets or any of that automatically adjust to uh, altitudes this one is remote start. It is 240 volt ready. If you have two of these and a special a combiner uh, parallel box, you can actually get 240 volt. This is just 120 volt on one generator. If you combine two, you can do the uh, 240 volt. You see, digital control, LED light, and it has a charging port. Let's get this thing open and get a closer look at it. All right, let, let's open up this box. Okay, guys, you can see right there, this generator does come with oil. So Gen Max does provide the oil. They do provide the oil for this generator. You have a charging. So when you put this generator in storage mode, you can charge it. Okay, you don't have to worry about the battery going dead. You have a wall charger. So let's plug this in, keep your battery full charged. You have a 12 volt cigarette lighter style USB output A and C. Little screwdriver and spark plug tool. This, this comes in handy. Your oil funnel for changing your oil and adding oil. So I want to show you guys a quick comparison. There are a few other generators in the same size that you can get. But now, instead of the 4600 right here, you have the 3500 IAED, which is a dual fuel 3500 watt inverter generator. You can get the 3500, the IAD, which is just the uh, pool start. So it is still dual fuel, but you have a pool start, no digital gauge. It's just a pull start. And this is the 2800, just gas. You do have your gauge, but Gen Max does make a few different um, size. The only one we don't have is the 4000. You can get a 4000, it would be right here. But this one over here, I wanna take a closer look at this. This is the fuel injected. All the rest are carbureted. This is the only fuel injected one. So 15% more fuel efficiency and 10% more power, okay? So you have a 4,600 watt compact inverter generator with LED light on top. There's a button right here for your light. Once it's running, you'll be able to turn that on. Full hours, voltage, load, gasoline meter, and the frequency. You have your power, overload light, and your low oil light. This is your reset for your uh, 20 amp plugs. This is your reset for that eight amp cigarette lighter style outlet. Push start, low idle, eco mode, main switch. Showed you this before. And this is where you can actually parallel this generator and get 240 volt with that special combiner parallel kit. Your grounds over here. It does have a 30 amp RV output. This is your communication port. So when you tie the two together and 120 volt output. And this right here is where I told you, when you store your generator, you'll be able to keep your battery charged. Just plug in that charger in right there. Real nice. One thing I love about this model is the telescoping handle so you can roll this thing around on the back wheels nice big wheels on the back in case you do forget and let your battery die you do have pull start so you can pull start it so like i was saying it has 4600 watts starting 3800 running this is perfect the size for an rv like a 30 amp rv this would be perfect you could put this in any compartment 
it does have CO carbon monoxide shut off so if you put this somewhere um, it will shut, it, shut itself off to protect you your life remote start there's your remote start you can stop start this thing from inside the RV or inside the house all right so it's 4,600 watts starting, 3,800 running. That gives you 120 volt, 31.7 amps. So that's what I told you. It's perfect for a 30 amp RV. You can get 31.7 amps. So everything in your RV will be able to run off this compact inverter generator. No problem, no worries. Let's get some oil in it and get it fired up. This one does come with its own oil, so we're going to add the oil at this time. You can use the funnel that it comes with. I'm going to use this one. Thirty oil, conventional. cool thing about this dipstick it comes with if you guys like adding your magnetic dipstick it does have its own magnet on its dipstick so you don't have to upgrade this it already come with the magnet Get your dipstick back on. and I'll show you guys real quick where the uh, this is a new fuel injected right there throttle body so no more carburetor once you put your oil in you come over here you'll see this white cable you're gonna connect it to this red and black cable down under I hope you guys can see this it's right here so we're gonna connect these two together And that's it. Now you tuck them back nicely. There you go. Okay, so that's the only thing we missed. Gas is in there. have your fuel in come to the front panel here's your main switch turn that on hear that fuel pump running the light came on you have a light switch right here if you don't need that light eco mode is off and hit that start button let's see how long it takes how many tries Two. Alright guys, there you have it. Gen Max electronic fuel injected generator. This is a 4,600 watts. I really like the light right here so when you're camping or working in your RV you have light right here especially if you have this outside Okay, so this is the unboxing video. Guys, I am gonna be trying this on the RV so we can do the AC. It is a bit cool right now, so I'll probably do a heater instead. Maybe it's warm enough the AC will come on if I set it all the way down, but stay tuned for that video. Guys, thanks for watching this quick video of the unboxing of the Gen Max. 
46 IAEFIC fuel injected generator. Let me show you a few other generators that we had that was fuel injected before this. So I'm going to compare this to one more generator. Stay tuned. Right now, these are the only two fuel injected generators I have. It's a 3200 Honda. Now we have the 4600 Gen Max. Both fuel injected. Guys, thanks for watching this quick video of Gen Max first EFI electric fuel injected generator. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day. Bye. Stay tuned for that uh, load test on this generator. Guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.